Accounting is the language of business. Accounting is an information system that identifies, records, and communicates relevant information about business activities. In the business world, the users of the accounting information can be divided into two groups, external and internal users. External users refers to people that are not working inside the company. They can be shareholders, directors, and customers, among others. They use this accounting information to make business decisions. They need to know financial accounting. For example, let's say that Donald Duck wants to invest $10,000 after all the success he had at Disney. Now, that makes him an investor, right? Here that Pluto's Pizza is really good and they want to expand. Donald Duck knows that $10,000 is a lot of money to risk. For this reason, he takes a look to Pluto's financial statements. Once again, he needs to know financial accounting. Internal users, on the other hand, are those directly involved in running and operating a business. They are focused in knowing how the business is doing and how it can improve. For this reason, they need to know managerial accounting. Pluto's Pizza is very successful not only because they serve great pizza, they are successful because they collect data and prepare reports to make good business decisions. By the way, did you know that one of the reasons why small businesses fail is because they have poor accounting? As a business person, you need to know where the money is going. If you don't know accounting today, it's a good day to start. You want to be successful? Learn accounting. How do I start learning accounting? A good start is to learn the accounting equation. The accounting equation is this. Assets equals liabilities plus owner's equity. An asset is what a company owns or controls. Liabilities are creditors' claims on assets. Equity is the owner's claim on assets. You can also say assets equals liability plus equity. Write it down in a piece of paper and make a song out of it if you want to. Just learn it. Play with it also. You can move the variables and make other formulas. For example, liabilities equals assets minus equity or equity equals assets minus liabilities. By the way, in accounting, you don't need to be a pro in math. If you know simple arithmetic and basic algebra, you'll be fine. Don't try to overthink this formula. I promise you, it will make sense, more sense when you learn more about accounting. For now, I insist, learn the accounting equation. If you want to know more about the accounting equation, to the next video and will give you examples that will help understand better. Thank you for watching.